like to know what you really are? Captain Marvel flew through the glass ceiling in its box office debut with $455 million in worldwide ticket sales, including $153 million in North America. The Brie Larson-led movie's global launch marks the biggest ever for a female-fronted film, as well as the second largest for any superhero movie behind Avengers Infinity War. Overall, it's the sixth best worldwide debut of all time, and its foreign opening of $302 million is the fifth biggest ever behind only The Fate of the Furious, Avengers Infinity War, Jurassic World and the final Harry Potter movie. Captain Marvel's performance so far internationally is of particular significance in the quest for gender equality on the big screen, signaling to Hollywood studios that an event movie starring a woman can hold its own around the world, and rival action movies featuring men. We made you one of us. So you could live longer, stronger, superior. So what's to thank for this record-breaking debut? According to IMAX Entertainment president Megan Colligan, I think we tend to perpetuate myths that are simply untrue, such as that men won't watch a female-led superhero movie, or that African-American superhero movies won't play overseas. The studios who have said no to those myths and have pushed to defy them have been wildly successful. In North America, Marvel and Disney's first comic book adaptation featuring a woman in a lead role also surpassed DC film Wonder Woman's debut of $103 million. Up next, Larson reprises her role in Avengers Endgame. All right, for the latest box office numbers and more on Captain Marvel, head to THR.com. Until next time, for the Hollywood Reporter News, I'm Tiffany Taylor.